let us present to you the CSIP process, which performs both CIP and SIP at the same time. First, the pipes are rinsed after the previous production run. Next, an alkaline or acid detergent is added and the temperature is increased. When the temperature reaches the CIP temperature, the CIP circulation timer starts. The detergent temperature continues to rise to the temperature required for SIP. The F sub O software starts when the detergent temperature reaches 121.1 degrees Celsius. When the accumulated value of F sub O reaches the specified level, 233 for example, SIP ends. When the CIP circulation timer is completed, it shifts to a sterile water rinsing process. The rinsing process removes the detergent with sterile water, which is sterilized by UHT itself. In the rinsing process, the temperature of the cooling section is lowered while maintaining the sterilization temperature. The temperature and flow rate of the UHT are constantly monitored to ensure that a septic performance is maintained. This constant monitoring system allows a quick shift to the next production condition while maintaining a septic performance even if the temperature and flow rate are changed simultaneously. The CSIP technology is developed by DNP and can reduce time, steam consumption, and CO2 emissions by eliminating the conventional SIP process. In addition, as CIP is performed at high temperature, not only is it very effective in cleaning, but it also shortens cleaning time, reduces the amount of detergent used, and saves water. This CSIP system can be installed in all sterile filling machines that perform CIP and SIP by partially modifying the equipment. DNP Aseptic